So welcome to this video lecture. So this is a continuation of the previous video. So in this video also I am going to find the mean value of uh, this function in between these two limits. So solution. First of all write down the given data. Given that y equal to e power t and lower limit is minus 1, upper limit is 1. Okay. What is the mean value formula? Mean value is equal to 1 by b minus a into integration a to b y dx which is equal to 1 by b value is 1 minus a value is minus 1 into integration a to b y y is e power t dt ok so here our variable is t that's why I wanted to write here t in the formula t which is equal to 1 by 1 minus to minus plus 1 Integration of e power t is e power t upper limit 1 dire limit minus 1 which is equal to 1 by 1 plus 1 is 2 substitute upper limit e power 1 minus then substitute lower limit e power minus 1 equal to e power 1 minus e power minus 1 by 2 or e minus e power minus 1 by 2 so e power 1 is e only ok let us do another problem also here So, in this problem, we have to find mean value of i is equal to a sin t over one complete wave. Solution. First of all, write down the given data. Given that i is equal to a into sin t over one complete wave. What is the sine wave? This is a sine wave. So, sin 0 is 0. Pi by 2 is 1. Pi is 0. 3 pi by 2 is minus 1, 2 pi is 0 and it is repeated same. So this is 0, pi by 2, pi. So this is 3 pi by 2, 2 pi. One come suppose start with this point. So then again when this uh, function reaches the same value with the same uh, properties means so here we get the same value. Okay or if you start here then we get the same value here so this is not same value because this is uh, the zero is is function so here pass to pass to, here the zero is decreasing value here from pass to maximum value to zero here this happen but here from negative to zero so this zero is uh, how this function reached to this zero from positive to negative here negative to 0 here also negative to 0 so this point and this point have the same properties ok so that's why I wanted to take a simple interval as 0 to 2 pi or you can take minus pi 2 pi or pi 2 3 pi you can take any one so I wanted to take 0 comma b is equal to 2 pi 0 comma 2 pi is one complete wave length of one complete wave so what is the mean value formula 1 by b minus a integration a to b i dt so here we have in previous uh, in, in our formula we have y here we have high ok substitute all values here 1 by 2 pi minus 0 0 to 2 pi i is a sin t dt which is equal to 1 by 2 pi into so a constant that a I am writing outside integration of sin t is minus cos t so upper limit pi lower limit 0 which is equal to a by 2 pi substitute upper limit cos 2 pi minus then substitute lower limit minus cos 0 which is equal to a by 2 pi into minus 2 pi is 360. 360 is equal to 0. Cos 0 is 1. Minus 2 minus plus. Cos 0 is 1. Is equal to A by 2 pi into minus 1 plus 1 is 0. So answer is 0. Okay. So here the interval directly not given. So you saying that 1 complete wave. 1 complete wave means it is enough to take 0 to 2 pi. Okay. Thank you for watching.